It is shaping up to be a big week for Tesla. Elon Musk is gathering investors today to show off the latest driverless technology two days before Tesla reports its quarterly results. Yahoo Finance's Rick Newman is joining us now. I don't know, this smells kind of stunt-like to me, <laughs> Good Rick. Good for you. Is it? I'm very skeptical. <laughs> well, the thing to keep in mind here is that Tesla doesn't have magic self-driving technology that no other car companies have. They all have basically the same technology, and most of the car companies are being very cautious in terms of how they roll this out, because you know they've been around for decades. They've been through uh, tons of lawsuits. They've been through uh, bad publicity on news magazines shows and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And that doesn't seem to face Tesla at all. Uh, there are safety advocates in the industry who think Tesla's just going too far too fast with this technology. Uh, we're getting there, but it's not really here yet to have what, what people would consider fully self-driving cars, a car that you get in, you take a nap, and you arrive at your destination mm. You know, a few minutes later. But that is what Elon Musk is apparently going to show off today. It is worth pointing out there have already been a couple of deaths in Teslas that were in uh, autopilot mode. That's the self-driving system in uh, Tesla vehicles. And uh, safety advocates worry that there will be more. You know, Rick, I know you've seen it all with Tesla. Outside of the self-driving thing, could this just be a disastrous week for Tesla? You have earnings. The guidance is unlikely to be good. The quarter itself, not going to be good. It's going to be another weird Elon Musk quarter. And he still uh, has conference the call. SEC issues. SEC I mean, issue. yeah. I mean, I think Tesla as a company is just a high wire act, which is why you see uh, such a bifurcation among investors. Either you love it and you're long or you hate it and you're short. <laughs> Uh, it, it's not really like anybody's sort of like, you know, buy and hold, you know, stable stock. Um, Tesla's going to probably have a cash crunch this year. That's another thing we might learn when we see mm -hmm. earnings. Uh, they, they had a dole out about a billion bucks for debt payments. Uh, so that's going to draw down their cash. There's concern they need to raise capital. I heard one estimate over $2 billion potential raise Could this be. year. Could be, yeah. Wow. And now Elon Musk has said we're, that's not going to happen. He doesn't foresee a need to raise capital this year. Yeah. But we know that he has set a lot of things and set a lot of deadlines that don't, don't come to pass. So I How think it is going to that yeah. secondary offering, you think? Uh, yes. Tesla? Yeah. yeah. What about course, this? That would dilute shares. Right. This exploding Model S in China. There, there. Now it is. Tesla is yeah. basically saying, no, this didn't happen. Apparently there was video of it. We don't know the details yeah. of this, but that's one of the concerns with batteries is, uh, I mean, th there are, this technology is pretty proven at this point, but the, you, you know, cars are subject to all kinds, people do crazy things with their cars. Uh, yeah. And you know, <laughs> car cars true. just end up in crazy situations, subject to crazy forces and circumstances. And um, this technology can combust. I mean, it is a risk. Uh, Tesla says it's under control. You know, again, they're not the only ones who have these kinds of batteries in cars. Many other automakers have them, and they're getting, you know, they're getting comfortable with. But that's why this is all. We're in the test phase for all right. this. I mean, electric vehicles are coming. Uh, they are going to be a bigger part of the fleet uh, for sure in the future. But there's a lot that still needs to be worked out. Yeah. So don't put uh, gas in your electric car. Right? No, no, don't yeah, go doing luckily that. Luckily, you can't. <laughs> yes, can. It's a leap of faith, though, for investors, for sure. I'll tell you what, I'm at the auto show. I look at some of the new cars. Everybody's rolling out electric cars. Yeah. And I'm not sure what's what. So I walk around to the back of the car and look at the tailpipe. It looks so dreadful. I, I, look, around, I, look, I, like around, I look around to see if it has tailpipes. And if there are no tailpipes, that means it's an electric car. So there are no I like how Rick Newman thinks. <laughs> That's how you can tell on the road. Look for the tailpipes.